What is up guys, welcome to Outdoors Nation TV. Today we're going to be talking about frog fishing, how to catch more frog fish, and also the setup that you would use for it. So the first thing that we're going to talk about is the setup. I have a Ducket Micro Magic Pro and it is a 7 foot 6 inch rod. This is um, a heavy kind so it's meant for more like frog fishing, punching, and flipping and all that stuff. Um, I have a Shimano Casitas 7-2 re ratio um, reel. This I just got off of Tackle Warehouse like I think a month ago or so. And I have, I think this is 50 pound braid um, Power Pro. This is very nice uh, line. The thing that's interesting about this rod is that the eyelids on this is all the same size and it's all small all the way through to give it uh, more accuracy and also to make it cast farther. Um, I think it's a very nice rod and I, if I were you, I would invest in one of these. So the next thing we're going to talk about is how to rig this. So the best way to, um, the best knot to use for this is a polymer knot. And the frog that I use with it is the Spro frog. It is, I don't know what color this is, but it's a black and yellow color. The way that I tie a polymer knot is this. So you start with your line. Now you go over like this. So now you have a little loop on the end. The next thing you do is put it through the hole. So then you have this. And now the next thing you do is you just tie a normal overhand knot. like so. So now you have this excess line and now you have a nice little loop right here. With this loop you should go all the way through your bait and the last thing you have to do is just pull on this line and then pull on this line. It's a, this is a really easy uh, knot to use. I think this is the strongest knot um, it's the best to use with braid and this is the knot that I use frog fishing and I do not uh, lose a lot of frogs to this knot. So this is the setup and the rig and everything that I use to catch these frog fish. Things to look for when you're frog fishing is obviously pads, uh, muck, just tree stumps, tree branches leaning over towards the shore and just stuff like that. Um, yeah, that's about it. So thank you guys for watching. If you haven't done so already, go click subscribe, turn post notifications on for upcoming videos. Um, if you think I did good on this video, give it a thumbs up. Um, if you didn't think so, um, comment down below what you think I can improve on. But also let me know in the comments what I should do for upcoming videos. I'm kind of out of ideas right now. So if you just let me know, I'll reach out to you and tell you what I think about it and I'll try to get that in our next video. So see you guys later. Thank you for watching. See you next time.